Hi, my name is Ka E. Ip and I'm from the University of Michigan, Department of Psychiatrist. Today I'm presenting at the 24th APS Annual Convention in Chicago. My research looks at the internalizing and externalizing behaviors of children of alcoholics living in different family structure. Although extensive research has shown that children of alcoholics are at risk for elevated internalizing problems such as depression and externalizing problems such as delinquency, most of the research has focused on children of alcoholics living in intact family with two biological parents, but ignore the fact that these children may also live in other family structures such as um, uh, family like single parent family and step families. But ironically, alcoholism is one of the uh, major causes that leading to divorce and th therefore these children are actually at risk for living in these kind of family structures. So I used the data from the Michigan Longitudinal Studies and we find that children of alcoholics living in staff families actually show higher level of internalizing and externalizing behaviors compared to non-alcoholic uh, families' children and more importantly, children of alcoholics in intact families. And the effect is still significant even after we control for social demographic characteristics, parental drinking problems and parental antisocial problems, as well as maternal depression. And this is really important because although research has never shown that, Actually, uh, children of alcoholics living in staff families are the most vulnerable group to ha have internalizing and externalizing behaviors. And this actually research not, add, not uh, only provide additional uh, uh, markers of heterogeneity for uh, researchers and clinicians to target those most at risk children, it also provide, we also hope that clinicians should be more aware of children of alcoholics living in staff families as they are the most vulnerable group among children of alcoholics families. Thank you so much.